so guys um this is the second video on um, xness so um on this video i will be showing you guys how to um trade on xness web terminal you can use it on your phone on your pc on your tab so um one thing i love about this new update is it makes the trading flexible now for you to do that instead of you holding your phone trying to navigate through the mt4 or mt5 so what you can do is this um you just type um xness slash um web web um web trading slash question mark tv equal to on or you just um just type xness web terminal it will take you straight into um this page you're seeing here so we'll allow it to load a little bit and i'll show you guys i don't need the notification i'll show you guys how this works it's very easy and straightforward and now they have integrated this um um they've integrated this um trading view so that everyone can chat so um now let's take a look at um how to place orders on um how to trade basically using the um this web terminal so i think the market is closed now so as you can see here market opens at this in the meantime you can trade cryptocurrency so let's click on cryptocurrency now look at this very well i want you guys to pay attention to this um we we'll have um this I have a pending order here which i this should have um triggered my order so i will look into this later but before that let's let's take a closer look at um how to place orders there are different orders i will be showing you guys how to place the first thing is how to place a buy stop limit order a buy stop limit order is an order you place above the market price a buy limit order is an order that you're placing below the market price saying that the market will drop pq and continue to pump to the upside why the buy stop limit order is an order that you place above the market price waiting for it to close above a range now um I'm going to show you guys that and I'll show you guys how to place the sell stop limit order and the sell limit order if you're going short. Now, let's assume in I want to, okay, this market is open, but I'm going to use um, the BTC and let me go down to lower time frame. So let's assume in you must have done your analysis here. After doing your analysis and you say, okay, um, this range, so you see now we have the trading tools here. So let's say um we're looking at this range here we're looking at this range here so i don't want to long this here um so i'm saying um i want when price goes above this level here it should pick me and continue to go up after doing analysis so um how to how will i place the buy stop limit order here so placing the buy stop limit order i'm going to copy this now i'm going uh, what i'm going to do here i'll go to the pending order then um after going to the pending order i would um, delete this and paste what i've copied um take note of this this is the order volume or the lot size what we'll call the lot size but we'll call it the order volume so what i'm going to do here is i'll leave it at this i'm just using this as an example uh, i don't know what you guys use but um be careful with the amount of lot size you use so now look at this since i'm placing this here i want to go long i want to go long i'll click on buy now do you see i have placed a buy stop limit order a buy stop limit order take note of that i have placed a buy stop limit order now um, additionally to that if okay let's assume i want to place a buy stop limit order my stop loss and my take profit so what i'm going to do i'll cancel this come back to the pending order here um i still have what i've copied i'll delete this paste it here 
then this auto close would now be my take profit let's assume my take profit would be here i would copy it here i would copy this copy bring it down here paste it here then my stop loss should be around here i would do something like this copy it again and um, put this here so what i would just do automatically i'll just click on what um buy so you can see um we have placed this and this so we don't need to do anything again we don't need to do anything again. we'll just leave it that way and allow it to run okay so we've placed a buy stop limit order buy stop limit order is an order you place above the market price it's an order you place above um, the market price okay so now that is all about the buy stop limit um, order so how can we place a buy limit order like i said a buy limit order is an order you place below the market price saying that okay if this comes down to this place it will pick me and go back up how would i do that okay this i'm going to do that so i would say what price is here i'll just okay this price is here i want to go long here so if i want to go long here i will just pick um i'll pick this here copy it which is this price here which i'm saying this will bounce here and to go back up so i'll just come to this place paste it and i'll do what go long now you can see i'm long here so and if it triggers my order or if it doesn't trigger my order i can still place my take profit and stop loss so it's not a must you place it immediately so you can place it even when um after you must have placed your buy limit order so let me cancel this that's about the buy limit order and the buy stop limit order now what about the sell stop limit order and the sell limit order let me quickly explain those two the sell limit order is an order you place above the market price so a sell limit order is an order you place above the market price is saying that price will come back up pick your order and continue to go down why is sell stop limit order is an order you place below the market price this is the market price now so um what i'm seeing here is a double top so i can say okay this will break down from here so i can place my sell stop limit order here very simple the same process so if i say i want to place a sell limit order and this is the price which i want price to come back up pick this and continue to go down so what i will do here so what i will do here is i will just um come here um copy this price when i copy this price i would um, um come to this pending order here and paste this here and click on sell when i click on sell automatically i've placed a sell limit order sell limit order is an order you place above the market price saying that the market will come back up pick you and continue to go down so let me delete this now i want to place a sell stop limit order i hope i'm not fast if i'm very fast please you can um, take it back and watch it over and over again so it's still sell stop limit order is an order you place below the market price saying that the, the price will break down this um level of support here and continue to push down so which is we are waiting for this pattern to be confirmed so i can do what come to this place copy um the price there which is this price i'm looking at here then we'll come to this pending it's a pending order you click on this and you click on sell so automatically you have placed a what a sell stop limit order very easy it is very very easy so after placing that you can place your take profit and your stop loss 
So you guys need to understand how this works, okay? It's very easy and straightforward. So that is how to place orders using the XNES web um, trading terminal. And um, by next week, um, I will be starting a live trading on um, XNES, how um, we can be taking trades daily, we'll make some profit and um, we'll move on. So if you haven't joined my Signal group, please do well to check the description, um, the link in the description below so as to join my Telegram group. So guys, happy trading and enjoy the rest of the night.